You're making excuses to spend time with me. This is exactly what I did with my wife when I wanted to spend time with you. Please do not compare our situations. Well, explain to me how they're different. We're not having an affair. Yet. Help me out. I want to check out no, your emails. Well, obviously you have to, then you'll see I've got nothing to hide. Well, that's my point. You were hiding them. You were hiding I them. I hid them because I knew this was how you were going to react. It's none like it. My always big. <laughs> I'm just sleeping. Honey! Oh. And I'm the one keeping secrets. This is not how it looks. Oh, hi, Ruth. Last week you wanted me to stay away from her, and now you're asking me to not stay away from her? I was wrong. Mate, she needs your help. I hate the way things ended between us, but I want you to be happy. I think friends is probably a big ask, but I think we've probably been through too much not to give it a shot. And the same goes for us. See your dilemma. He's hot. Oh, thanks for pointing that out. He's got good qualities, doesn't he? <clears throat> oh, Harvey. Hey. Hi. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. Oh, that's OK. Uh, Ruth, we need to talk. Uh, are you communicating with me? That's such a novel concept. Leah, would you give us a minute? Yep, of course. Thank you. Um, look, the thing is, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I've, I've got no right to get on my high horse about your emails to Tim. Yeah, well, glad we agree on I mean, God knows, I've done my fair share of putting this relationship to the test with Mel and Lottie and all the secrets. Yeah, I guess so. So I've got no right getting uh, self-righteous when your past to rise on our doorstep. I agree. So, here's the thing. I love you. I love you more than I've loved anyone. And I'm not going to stand around and watch it slip away. What are you doing? Ruth Stewart, I, I don't want to wait three months. I want to marry you. And I want to do it right now. Or as soon as I can get it organised. <laughs> so come with me and get the marriage licence. What do you say? Yes, yes. Yes. Then all we have to do is ring Tim and tell him to take his job and shove it. Excuse me? Well, the one thing that's come out of this is that he can't be trusted. You are unbelievable! What? Oh! What? Oh. What'd I say? Oh. 